Well, here I am entering the main mission simulator of Star Center in Dania Beach, Florida. One of the most advanced maritime training facilities in the world. We have Captain Tour with half of the bridge team doing a, a really advanced uh, simulation right now going into Labadee in Haiti. Five, five, zero, zero to the, end, uh, dolphin. the bridge itself has all the same systems, technologies that we have on the Oasis of the Seas. Uh, the layout is somewhat different, more compact, because it was actually modeled after our Voyager class ships. But from a maneuvering perspective, from a navigation perspective, it's, it's exactly the same bridge. And the realism is unbelievable. This is the ship that we're on right now. The hydrodynamic uh, characteristics of the ship are exactly modeled. They've been compared to the actual sea trial data so that we know that the model that we're maneuvering right now is the Oasis of the Seas for all intents and purposes. For us, when we are in the simulations, it's like we are on the ship. We act the same way, we communicate the same way. We have to do the same things on the simulator as we have to do on the ship. The difference is, of course, that if we don't do it correct, the consequences are just some scraping noises in a loudspeaker and not uh, a two-week dry dock somewhere. This is not a video game. Uh, so we practice all the bridge procedures that we normally have. We have a, a pre-arrival briefing where the whole bridge team that's going to be participating in the arrival discuss what we're going to be doing, how the maneuver is going to be conducted. We do the same thing before every departure on every ship departing every port. So coming here and doing these simulations and doing this refresher on, on DP, that helps me to really build my confidence uh, that, uh, yeah, when we go out on Oasis to do this, we're going to make it just fine.